COVID-19 cases in Ontario are continuing to decrease. A positive sign phase one of the province's opening plan will soon come into effect. It gives us the confidence that we're getting close to opening parks, that we're getting close to opening retail for curbside pickup. It gives us the confidence that we're on the right track. Hardware stores, garden centers and nurseries have already been able to reopen their doors and many construction projects have been able to resume. Retail stores with a street entrance have also been able to open for curbside pickup, bringing a sense of normality to these unprecedented times. The Victoria Day long weekend has been eyed as a possible target for having more access to outdoor spaces and it seems that wish has been granted. This was a very productive week for Ontario businesses beginning to reopen. But when it comes to other restrictions being lifted, most of it has to do with outdoor activities. Today, Premier Doug Ford announced that provincial parks will be reopening for day use. These places will be open for walking, hiking, bird watching and biking. People will be able to once again enjoy the outdoors in one of our many beautiful parks and conservation reserves our province has to offer. The Premier says access to the 500 provincial parks and conservation areas will be limited for now, with campgrounds, play equipment and beaches remaining closed for the time being. Physical distancing will still be in effect and people will have to gather in groups of less than five people. But with the warmer weather arriving and people itching to get away, Government officials are asking everyone to stay as close to home as possible to stop the threat of COVID-19 spreading through travel. Ontarians should still be reducing the amount of unnecessary travel to other areas of the province. So if you're planning to visit a provincial park, please only visit the one that is closest to your community. While staff are working as hard as they can to get provincial parks ready to open, they will not have washrooms or drinkable water right away. It's important that you come to the park prepared with hand sanitizer, extra water and other supplies just in case. That brings the question as to why the province continues to open with COVID-19 cases still climbing. It's expected half of confirmed cases are caused by community spread, many people not knowing where they contracted the virus. Premier Ford says it's an important move to restart the economy, saying inspectors will be in place to ensure businesses are following the proper guidelines. Labour inspectors will be doing their job and in inspecting the, the, the stores and uh, especially the big box stores. You know, they, they probably have more contacts overseas on, on buying masks than than we do. On Thursday, the National Capital Commission announced off-leash dog parks will reopen for local use on Tuesday, May 19th. But despite being allowed to bring your dog there to run around, parking lots will remain closed for the distant future. Charlie Sinak, TBYN News, Ottawa.